Dan Henderson. Our tale of the take for this middleweight fight. The Canadian is 26. The American is 45. McDonald is one inch taller. He will have a two inch reach advantage. And now with our official introductions, here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC middleweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. A greco roman wrestler, only a professional record of 32 wins, 14 losses. He stands 5 feet 11 inches tall, weighing in at 185 pounds. Fighting out of Temecula, California, And now he his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is an ex martial artist, holding a professional record of 18 wins, 3 losses. He stands 6 feet tall, weighing in at 185 pounds. Fighting out of Montreal, Quebec, Canada, Rory! Mario Yamasaki, our referee. Rory McDonald. Here you go. First one, you ready? Dan Henderson. You ready? Here go, go. we go. Fight scheduled for three five minute rounds. White trunks for Henderson. Black trunks for McDonald. Rory McDonald is one of the very best of the new breed of mixed martial artists. Didn't have a background in any individual discipline, but has, from the beginning, trained entirely in mixed martial arts. Fantastic striking, fantastic jujitsu, and a very intelligent fighter. Dan Henderson looking for another highlight reel knockout. The one against Bisping Joe, one of the greatest in MMA history. Good roundhouse kick to the midsection. Swing and a miss. Nice work on the count. Both men landing in that exchange. Joe, you can hear Faraz Sahabi in his corner telling him to stay busy. He slips the punch. Very good job of timing these shots here. McDonald with the left. Nary swung with a haymaker. Inside leg kick lands. Oh, he down, completes man. the suplex. That's it, free the lead. Trying to close the distance. Looking to take him down again. Got him down. Can he keep him down? Excellent movement on the ground here. Constantly moving, constantly staying busy. Good elbows by Henderson. Here's a little piece of trivia for folks who don't know. The reason why you're not allowed to do a downward elbow, 12 to 6, is because when they first brought mixed martial arts to athletic commissions, the people on the commission said, well, you can't let someone do that. I saw people break bricks with that on ESPN. <laughs> In reality, there's really very little difference between a downward elbow or a 45-degree elbow or, or what have you. Solid grounding. Man, those elbows have been dangerous. Good elbow by Henderson. Oh, nice elbows there. Oh, man. This fight very well may be stopped in between rounds just because of the blood loss, Mike, because that is extraordinary. And another vicious elbow. Man, Joe, that's good ground and pound. He's really staying busy. Nice elbow. Damaging elbows from side control. Joe, those are solid elbows. Henderson with a nice elbow. There's another elbow. Good elbows. Elbow. There's a nice elbow again. That hurt him. Excellent ground and pound here, not giving his opponent any breaks. Henderson with an elbow to the head. He is landing some absolutely nasty elbows. Henderson with a good elbow. Oh, nice elbow again. Big elbows by Henderson. Our first round is in the books. 